Hey guys, Mike and Dave here from TwoAverageDudes.com. Hi. We just finished enjoying some Popeye's chicken. Delicious. Check out our review later tomorrow. Yeah. But today, Dave, what are we talking about? What do you think? Well, we got to keep talking about Justin Trudeau. Because what happened today? Ipso Reed came out with her latest poll of Justin Trudeau. And Justin Trudeau's approval rating is at an all-time low. Justin Trudeau. Are you surprised, honestly? Justin Trudeau's approval is worse than, than Trump. Donald Trump's! Are you surprised, honestly? Not at all. Because how did we get here? How did we get this way? And you know, and honestly, when we asked uh, in the one video there where we asked the liberal supporters, some people came on there, and I was actually surprised. I'm impressed how many of you guys said you actually supported Trudeau. Yeah, thank not, you, but now you regret it. Yeah. But at least you came forward and said you did it. Yeah. But you know, his approval should be at zero. We got the mm. embarrassment in India. You know? No, I don't agree with that. What's that? I don't agree with his you know, things should be at zero. You know why? Because there's always going to be those people that yeah. love his hair. Yeah. Or, but but still, though. If they you, if you look they believe the government's lies. If you lies. look at poli politically, though, if you go based on political, the way the guys handle himself, it should be at zero. Okay, you got the embarrassment in India. You got that him, was such an embarrassment. You, you, got, him, oh my you got him yelling at the ladies in the town hall back in the day. Yeah. That was smacking that one. Uh, the one. Remember the one day in Parliament where he went yeah. and yeah, uh, yeah. You got uh, groping. You got the groping incident. You know, um, <laughs> the, the list goes on. The budget hasn't balanced itself. We're still in the deficit now. This year didn't magically you know balance itself. We have S and C Lavalin. We have him getting beaten down by Donald Trump. Yeah. Oh, we have the new incident from last night. Which one? Oh, the one where the protester was at a, a big fancy swag dinner for that was Justin Trudeau. And he was asking about some... I asked him a direct question. About some native um, whatever issue. And, and, and Donald Trump didn't want to uh, Justin Trudeau didn't want to answer it because it was Don a negative answer. So what's he say? Thank you. Thank you for your donation of $1,500. Because that was the cost of being there. Like... Every day, you know, there's something new. Doesn't that just show, like, you know, a direct when somebody asks you a direct question and you don't answer? Number one, that's pretty ignorant. Yeah. Okay. But then to insult them and say thank you for your donation, you know, the guy oh, speaks with. Don't forget China. <laughs> the China incident. <laughs> We're botched ties with China. Um, he's bullying the women. Way bold and Phil Potts, bully, bully, bully. So, bully, bully, bully. So from a political standpoint, I can't see how anybody can approve of the guy. Politically, no. But there is always those people yeah. who think that, oh, he's putting a carbon tax on because he loves everything. You know what? Okay. You, you want to know, do you want to know the truth about things? This weed thing. Do you know why they brought weed to make it legal? What's it's not, opinion? it's not you. It's not me. It's not... Joe Blow, it's not anybody, it's not any Canadian. You know what it is? It's taxes. It's all they want is tax dollars. Yes, and they're even botching that. Yeah. Because they're saying the drug dealers you normally buy your drugs from don't have to collect tax because they're not registered distributors. Mm -hmm. Well, they should have done so anybody can sell drugs all they want. They just got to collect submit. the tax dollars and submit. Yep. That was the answer. So they botched again. Yeah, and it, but the only reason they did was taxes yeah. taxes and now and now you got this carbon tax coming out watch gas prices skyrocket but, the next and, you know month guys a lot of people think oh the carbon tax is good it's not good it's not about saving the environment it's See, about filling their pockets if it was all about saving the environment okay truthfully what we do as canada is we'd put the carbon tax on we would okay and then we wouldn't give any rebates back okay we charge it for using a little bit of carbon here and then we give the money to other countries that are actually polluting the world to try and help them stop pollution if we we're really concerned about the environment. Because Canada's pollution is minuscule it's compared different. to the rest of these countries. So the money should be going to them to help them stop polluting yeah. if, you were, if you were really doing, an doing it for environmental purposes. That's why I say, like, yeah. why are we being punished? Yeah. We produce so little, yeah. but we're being punished yeah. so much got where the rest do. of the world is just cranking yeah. out all these hydrocarbons and everything yeah. else just... I don't yep. care. It's got nothing to do with the government. No, it's... And the thing is, though, you know, there is other things that they could do. 
They could they could ban a lot of stuff that produces a lot of pollution, oh, yeah. but they don't. Yeah. You know why? Because it's money. It all Back boils down. down to money. Uh, That's it. Over and over. I forgot my favorite thing. What? I forgot my favorite Justin Trudeau moment. What? The apologizing oh. to, to the... To the... To the... House of Commons? No, no. Which? The chocolate bar incident? No, no. The killer. Oh, cripes. Like accused killer of a U.S. military person. No, he wasn't accused. No, no, like I, I, he was I, convicted. Convicted. That's what I meant to use the word convicted. I meant convicted. The convicted killer of a U.S. military person, and he injured another person. And we said we're sorry that you had to. And get arrested not for only that. that, we're gonna get ten point five million dollars. And not only that. They wiped his credit. They, That's right. He doesn't have to report now. He's just a free it's man. Gone. It's he gone. bought a friggin' mall out in, uh, out in Alberta somewhere. Yeah, everything's all sponge now. Yeah. But I'm glad, I'm glad you also brought up the Justin Trudeau sneaking the chocolate bar. So yeah. That was a good one, too. Yeah. yeah. The only thing I think I've heard him apologize for is a friggin' chocolate, chocolate bar. bar. What an idiot. So there you go, guys. Justin's approval rating came out today. All-time low. And we can exactly see why. You know Honestly, in this thing, I want to say more, but I hear his name and I start to get mad. I, I sit there and I'm getting so angry. Well, you can't say more without swearing or saying words that we can't use on here. Yeah, and then yeah. you get booed. But yeah. I get so angry listening to all this garbage, yeah. and sometimes I just have to sit and be quiet and let right. Mike talk because Mike can control himself better. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, check out our website, 2 yeah. Check out our polls and surveys. And uh, also make sure to check out our Popeye's review and let us know what you think Come about it. Come up in a day or two. Yeah. You know, give us your opinion on Popeye's chicken. Yeah. Take care, guys. Right, guys you can think good. of anything else, put it down there, too. That's right, yeah. We're going to make a big master list the closer it gets to election time. That way we can remind everybody of what an idiot he is. Just just in case somebody forgets something, That's we're right. going to remind In case he gets a new haircut before election. Yeah, yeah. Maybe grows a little scruffy beard to try. Little, and, yeah. One of those little Yeah, maybe he'll grow something to make himself. Uh, yeah, look like yeah. a pirate. Yeah, so we'll remind you guys all. Ass pirate. <laughs> Have a good one, guys. Later. <laughs>